Hey guys, uh, doing a video, quick video on the my compost tumbler. Uh, this is something I built last summer, and this is my first winter with it. Uh, and it's been it's been great. We uh, do a fair amount of cooking, so this is some of my my food scraps getting ready to go in. I have a couple bags here, and then these are coffee grounds from work. I'll dump those directly onto the yard, although it's kind of iced over right now. Um, I wasn't sure how much work it was going to be to do this over the winter, but it's done pretty well. It's getting ready for an empty. I should probably switch this out and add more leaves to it. So this is a full winter's worth of stuff, and I packed this thing pretty much full of leaves. So it's rotting uh, down pretty good. It's warm in here. Um, the other week when I went to spin it, I actually had stuff growing in it, which was pretty cool. Like, I think it was um, the, the leeks coming up or green onions. And those of you who have ever composted, like, there's no odor to this. Like, you can see there's there's food in here. It smells actually kind of oniony. It smells nice. So, uh, my update. I should switch this over. Um, uh, now, I did backstock some leaves so they were convenient to get to in my shed. Uh, and that bin right there. So, if I did need to switch it over this winter, it was going to be an easy flip-flop. I could just dump that out into the wheelbarrow and just dump it somewhere for now. Uh, first year doing cover crop, uh, it's doing well. That's the winter rye. I don't know if any of the other stuff that was blended in there made it. Uh, the yard is pretty well under snow right now. Had an almost blizzard come through. But um, I'm happy. It'll be interesting to see once we get a pop of warm weather uh, how, how tall this gets. People say it gets like one, two feet tall easily. So. Just waiting for everything to go out. Uh, the coffee grinds, I do add into my compost bin. My home coffee grinds go right in. Uh, but stuff I gather from work, I have the, the bartender save me all the espresso stuff. Uh, that I put right onto the yard. Um, you could say maybe, oh, are you putting too much acidity down? But I have a lot of leaves down and seaweed and a few other things. So uh, there's no way I'll get enough coffee grinds to affect this acidity. Just something else to compost to keep it out of the landfill. Uh, this is my compost update. I got some leaves backstock there. There's 20 or so leaf bags I backstock for this summer So I have a bunch of stuff to compost with because in the heart of the summer you kind of run out of stuff to compost with that's carbon so Working on it. I'll give you enough more updates to come